Well, gee, Mario, the game's a little more facious than you thought. Welcome back to Mario Galaxy 2. Welcome back. You dumb motherfucker, you're screwed. So, this is the post post. If there's no face in the beginning, what's the point? Well, just love his giant face. I guess so. So, a pun wasn't necessary in this case. Look at all these comments you can get. Yeah. Yeah, this is the post post game oh where gosh. there's about double the amount of stars to get no. that we have right now. The entire world is saturated with new content. Can't the game just be over? Why no. can't they? It can never be over. 30 hours is a fine amount of time for a game to be. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> What's it? Um, Slubba gangster? I suppose he Isn't is. Is a mafia? Hey yo, the Don wants you to get some green stars, Luigi. Hey yo, take these green stars and snort them. <laughs> it's good drugs. You gotta do it to prove you're legit. Even though you're undercover. <laughs> It's a test. It's the first of many tests. So, smart Mario players may remember in the first game, the post-post game of Galaxy 1 was doing the whole game again, but as Luigi. This uh -huh. time, it's a little bit different. There are more stars in each galaxy, but they're unique. See? Uh-huh. I can see them, <laughs> yes, but... See? Do you, do you get the naming convention no, they're well, going with I, here? I think I do. Oh, wow, and look, the... It's almost like the game itself is trying to tell us something with this color swapping. But what do these green stars mean? Is it just some sort of hidden way for you to get the stars you already got again, or is there something more to it? I literally do not know. I also don't know. Well, going back to the very first world, it acts like the very beginning- oh, do you hear that? Mm. I, I think I hear something. Hmm. Mm. There's a- uh... Oh. Well. A star. <laughs> and that's the whole post-post game. <laughs> All right. Well done. I thought about having the first video just be that. <laughs> and then closing the thread. Are they all that cheap? It's quite interesting, and I love it. So three, two to three green stars per galaxy just hidden in random places. Okay. Some places more malicious than others, some rather clever, and some kind of pointless. I liked the seagulls back there on the face station. Face station. I just need to point out your cool parkour skills, not going the linear route here. Well, we've uh, done this before, so... Well, be that as uh, please a be quiet. Please, please be quiet for a second. Oh my gosh. Sh shut up. Okay, you were saying? Nice one-ups. Oh my gosh. So do you hear that I again? I hear another star, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm here. What if you're deaf? Then don't play this game! Wow. But where it is was. it? Oh. Let's fly! Beep, beep, beep. There it is! You could see the little shine come uh. out a little bit there. So there's three keys. The three S's, I like to say. Sight. Sound and shadow. Oh, I nah, see. Those are the things you need to pay attention to. Sound is the most important one. The green stars are very loud. So once you're in the general vicinity, you should be able to hear it and get clued in, and then you want to start scavenger hunting. That's okay. So number three takes us to iteration number two. Hmm, this is a cool level. It is. So what do you think? Where's where's the green star gonna be? Um, I bet you have probably to fall on somewhere it. in this level. There it is. <laughs> probably somewhere in the level. I think I just saw it. I bet it's on a wooden plank. You can hear it. I think I was wrong. There it is. Oh, it's not on a wooden plank. Yeah, it's it's not particularly well hidden. Some they just drop in there and like ah whatever. <laughs> they can't all be scavenger hunt gold. How come Mario doesn't get red stars? Red stars? Because he's. Because Luigi's green, he gets the green stars. Mm hmm. Um. Go on. Well. Mario is privileged and he gets normal stars. Luigi is, uh, the lower class of this world and he, uh, his stars are colored specifically for him. He can't have the mm -hmm. same stars or the same opportunities. 
So we know we're 100% done with the galaxy when a little gold crown appears next to it. We'll never have to go back there again. Hooray! Oh God. So now on to the first appearance of Yoshi Galaxy. A whole galaxy for Yoshi? <laughs> Another thing with the green stars, you can sometimes just see them when it pans across to introduce you to the galaxy. Yeah, like you could see two, you saw two of them actually just now. If you pay attention. Luigi's burning up on re entry. Nothing has changed as far as how the galaxies are introduced or how the levels operate. They're just, you know, new stars. Great. Yeah! Alrighty, yeah! Well, I mean, Luigi's into it. What? So, how are we gonna get that first star that's way over there? It's too high. Can Luigi jump that high? I don't think he can jump that high. Can he jump higher this than Mario? help us? I forget his name. Yoshi? No. <laughs> the wizard. Goomba? What's Wizro. The, what's the wizard's name? Magi Koopa. Oh, really? Yeah, Magi Koopa. Magi Koopa? Or Kamek. Kamek is the special Kamek. that's what one. I meant. Oh, Kamek. Well, he's the special one that, like, talks and shit. Oh. Luigi might actually have the vertical leap to get that without Yoshi, but I don't know. Can you play this this with Mario? Can you collect? You can. With Mario? I did an informal poll to see oh, did people I want see. just Mario, did they want Luigi, or did they want a mix of both? And uh, nothing but Luigi won with about fifty percent of the vote. Jeez. Mario alone only got like seven to eight percent. People are over Mario. They've had to see him for an entire He's got game. his own face uh, ship. He's had enough of the spotlight. Mario's plastered all over this game, I think. Uh, even if you're not playing as him, you uh, still experience quite a lot of Mario. <laughs> it's true. Hey, there it is. There it is. Oh. Good, good eyesight, Cherry Doom. <laughs> Yoshi sounds a little distressed whenever he's trying to fly. Luigi's got kind of a fat ass. <laughs> yeah. It's a burden. It weighs down on him. I think... I think every character in this game has a fat ass. Look at that Luma. Look at fucking Luba. <laughs> hey, I don't even have an ass. Everybody's very pear-shaped. I gotta say, I love oh. those seagull sound effects. Again. Great. You love great. birds. <laughs> Alright, so I'm sorry. No, it's... I wasn't trying to say you're a bad person for that. So, star number three, you have to go through pretty much the entire galaxy. And that's probably the one downside if there are any galaxies you're not a particular fan of. You have to do them a lot of the times again. Wait, a level is called a galaxy? Yeah. Hmm. What? You have a problem with that? A solar system at most. <laughs> or planet, perhaps? I mean, there are, there are like, well, it's chunks a series that you of have to, yeah, so... Yeah, solar system sounds more. Please. Planetary system? Planetary mm. system with the moons and whatnot, sure. Because I haven't seen a sun yet. So there's the original star, but well, then... Well, something's shining. Nice. A fucking Yoshi! <laughs> <laughs> he fell to his death. <laughs> I mean, he did just then. He did, yes. Yeah. One of the darker sides of playing as Luigi. Grind that Yoshi up into glue. He's useless to us now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because he's like a horse, right? Dinosaurs make glue? When you he's a dino horse. Process their scales? I'm you sure just, you can get glue you... from the marrow of any bones. Yeah, any bone you can at make all. Make human glue. It's just that horses have a lot of bones. Yeah. Human glue! <laughs> <laughs> let's, uh, let's. Dig around for some more stars, shall we? Okay. Left. That's my transition attempt. Alright. Boy, you don't want to keep talking about human glue? <laughs> I find human glue very interesting. Almost as interesting possible. as Yoshi glue. Another thing, when you pan across the galaxies, you can hear the stars then also. So you can get a hint of, oh, maybe the star is in that general area. That's a nice hint. Mm hmm. Again, sight, sound, shadow. I mean, whatever I just said. <laughs> it's like a superhero trio. Mm -hmm. Problem with not having played these galaxies in a while is I kind of forgot what you're supposed to do here. Or where you're supposed to dig precisely, rather. What is going on? Well, you gotta dig in the right hole. 
But fortunately I got the extra lives, because this is a trying series of levels we're doing. Well, it looks like you're trying your best. Yeah. No one can fault you for that. What? Eck. Hmm? Well, Luigi did, you know, smash his head. You caused him to turn into a different non-living creature. In other words, you've killed him. So you hear it. I do hear it. I hear it but too. But where is the shadow of it? You know, shadow and sight are kind of the same thing. It could be anything. First person view is what you want to do after, you know, getting rid of opposition, and then... Aha! Uh -huh. oh. I was lucky. Set your waypoint! This is a pretty clever hidden spot. Oof, that's cool. See, some of the hidden spots are pretty clever, pretty nice. So a lot of the times the stars are just there. A lot of times you have- the worst ones are the ones that you only really have one opportunity to get them. Like a do or die kind of scenario. And there are a fair number of those. Hmm. They have to make crazy leaps too, and if you miss, you're gonna die. Yeah. Yeah! This star is not exactly one of those, but this is a little bit tricky. Watch out for that black hole, I guess. Watch out for that. Astral toilet. <laughs> <laughs> that is what it is. I hear it. Do you see the shadow? Mm, yes. yes, I do. It's behind that Goomba. It's very high as well. If you're Mario, you pretty much need to do a triple jump. If you're Luigi, you might be able to backflip it, followed by a spin jump. That's why, for the most part, getting these with Luigi is a bit easier, because he has the vertical advantage. His oily shoes can be annoying sometimes, but not too much. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, this animation again. Got it some just coins. gives us a chance to settle, to collect our thoughts, to break our head against the wheel, and then go into the next area. Uh, I hear yes. it. It's down to the left. Yeah, no, it down is. the left is nothing. Oh. Well, it's in the left head. It's right there! Whoa. But how are we gonna get this? Star Wars carrying a drill like that! Take the drill off your head. Throw the drill at the star. Yeah. That's a good idea. But you can triple jump while you're holding those things. Aha. Nice. Booyah, says the Don't lady. need that drill anymore. That it also has fallen to its death. It has. If it was ever living. <laughs> Drilly! <laughs> uh. God, you just... All you do is you use people, and then you just throw them <laughs> away when you're done with them. They're not people. I'll never forget what you did to Drilly, Luigi. Or, you know, metaphorical people. I guess they're not really... I saw what you did. I saw what you did. I know everything. Now back to one of the cool galaxies. The flip swapping. Do you like to flip swap? I love flip swap. No. No? It's so fun. Well, you're weird. You should try it sometime. It's a feature of this game. Where would I go to flip... to flip... <laughs> uh, YouTube, probably. A poker game? <laughs> no. Oh, hey, there's a star. Where can I flip swap in my area? Uh, Craigslist is a good place to find out. Play some, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh... <laughs> also that. So galaxies like this that are pretty open, it's pretty obvious where the stars is. The challenge is just getting them in the first place. Okay, I changed my mind. This is pretty cool. I'm liking this, these flip swaps. God, you Come on, you've seen this before. Glad no, you haven't. joined the flip swap fold. You've seen this before because you kept up with my LP. Yes. Yep, I sure did. <laughs> Thank you. There's the sound. First person view. There's the sight. <laughs> Does that look good? Uh... There's the shadow. That's the Beatus method. <laughs> There's the shadow. I already said that. How are you gonna get the star if everything is flipping and swapping? Well, if you're Mario, I believe you need to do a triple jump to get it. Which I'm trying to do as Luigi, but... Can't... You need just a wee little bit of momentum to get through the triple jump, but you can also just backflip if you're Luigi. Is there a trigger for the flip swapping or does it just do it on intervals? Cause that when took you a long spin, time. Ooh. When you spin, Whoa. you are in control of the flipping and the swapping. Oh. That's right. So you can stop whenever you're uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Good. 
<laughs> yes, that's correct. So the special galaxies like this usually only have two green stars as opposed to three. There's the second one way over there. Where's that? Where's that? There, Bow Wow. Little Bow Wow? No, Bow Wow. Little Bow Wow the rapper? He's not a character in this game. If you were. Chainless Chomp. Not. Chainless uh, Chomp. Yeah, if you were not going by uh, Link's Awakening. Well, this is not a Zelda game, so I choose not to. Are you sure right. this isn't a Zelda game? So. I mean, the main character is green, right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, player character. So we got the shadow, we know what to do, but this time, I'm gonna show you how a pro triple jumps this shit. Uh. See? <laughs> that was very pro. Wow. That was very pro. But you know what? I'm stubborn. I want to triple jump this. Beatus gets what Beatus wants! <laughs> what he wants is that green star, so let's go. Let's go back. Yeah. That was my motto when I started this LP. <laughs> and it's it's still true today, mm -hmm. as we can see. It 100% is. Just another opportunity to collect our thoughts. Mm -hmm. Listen to the seagulls. Listen to the seagulls. <laughs> The seagulls won't last forever. Oh. Why not? Yeah, They're a limited commodity. Perhaps like this world or whatever. Oh, yeah. Fluffy Buff. No. I really like that name. Fluffy Buff Galaxy, or any cloud galaxies, are very malicious for green stars. Because with the cloud power up, you can go many places. And so the stars are scattered in many faraway places. Get it? Got it. Yes. Good. Did you see any? Uh, yeah, I, I see saw one, one right over there. Yeah, yeah there you go. So you're getting into the scavenger hunt now, huh? Yeah? Yep. We're using my sights. And hey, look, a shadow right there. Heavily invested in, uh, <laughs> this. But... Chills is being me now. <laughs> Not even Luigi can make that kind of jump. This game is bullshit. Look at that Stupid fucking bird. <laughs> <laughs> so mad! <laughs> uh, where'd he go? There he is. He went back there. What? He'll 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 come back, Cherry Dan. What is more. this power? You come on, you know what the cloud does. Like, why do I have you in these videos? <laughs> you always gotta have someone who knows about the game and someone who doesn't know about the game. I I heard about it on your podcast. I'm the one who doesn't know about the game. I don't know about it either. Well, shit. Then I guess, uh... I guess he didn't do the thing that he says he did, because he's a liar. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So in case you didn't note, if you do a triple jump, you only really need two clouds to get that star. In case you waste one. So don't worry. I won't. It's okay. It's fine. I'm at ease. And if you fail, don't worry, the game saves in the cloud. <laughs> Back to Mario Galaxy 2. <laughs> so, you may note that this is the very end of the level where that green star is, which means I actually missed green star number two. What? I know. Oh no, indeed. <laughs> Wait, was that Trills or was that Toad? That was Toad. <laughs> <laughs> you can't tell the difference? Well, you, I'm just saying you could probably do that. <laughs> if you wanted to. <laughs> if I wanted to, being, uh... The key here. Yeah. Uh-oh. Well, you fucked up now. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. oh, really? Who knew that clouds were so fragile? I fucked up at doing something completely uncool. <laughs> more more like that. More like that. More like that. So, should be pretty obvious by now, but green star number one, generally early in the level. Green star number two, midpoint-ish. Number three, near the end. Alright. Got it? Alright. Which means we need to go back to the middle of the level, where we can hear the star, but we're- oh. Mm. Look at that cloud! <laughs> it's so cute! That's- <laughs> that's pretty way over yonder. Not that far yonder, though. Mm. So this is why 3D can be inconvenient at times. And cameras. <laughs> but don't fret! Do you have control over the camera? 
not all the time. A lot of the times it just shifts willy-nilly on you. But, all we have to do is go up. Yeah. So what are your thoughts on this post-game? Uh, seems alright. I mean... I wouldn't do does it. Does it appeal to you personally as a gamer? Nope. Uh, no. not really. Are you're not a collector of things? No. Um, not for- Like Cherry Doom, you like Pokemon and bullshit like that. You like to collect all of them. No, I don't. Why would you not want to apply that same principle of collecting them all? I just want to get the cutest ones and be the Elite Four and then I'm done. <laughs> the green stars are fucking adorable, though. <laughs> are you right side down with that? What? Right side down with that. What? With what I just said, are like, are you, are you said, are you down with that? But then I said, are you right side down with that? Because that's the name of this galaxy. Oh, yes. Are you right side down with that? That yes. was the joke. Thank God. you. <laughs> <sighs> now, actually, both of these stars are near the end of the level, but I wanted to start at the beginning just to show you how far I have come as a player of Luigi. <laughs> Wow. Huh? Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> the star is right above Luigi, but... Mm. It gets a little vomit-inducing. <laughs> a little bit. Oh god. God, this music! <laughs> it it kind of fits with the music, what he's trying to do. Yeah, yeah blah! I am starting to really like these seagull sounds now that you've pointed them out so many times. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm, I'm reasonably sure that they're only in World 1, so once we go to World 2... <sighs> well, I'm, I'll be And once that. you get even further, they become, like, undead skeleton seagulls. No, well, that's okay. No, well, as long as they're still undead. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. So star number 2, at the very end, there are two ways you can go about getting it, but I prefer... Whoa. Saying fuck gravity Whoa. and going up here. Whoa. Whoa. That's a good life hack right there. So when you scale that wall, you're not affected by the down arrows, and you can just go straight to the end where the star is. Wow. You. Then, not quite sure what happened <laughs> there. <laughs> you can also get up there just by uh, going through the swamps and back flipping. Um, all those wahoos were me. Okay. <laughs> Just letting you Thank know, you. in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> How come the star shadow is just kind of a circle, but then Luigi's shadow kind of resembles him? What's up with that? What is that I don't know. Else? I don't think a star would even cast a shadow. I mean, it is made of light. Right. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Well, it casts other shadows, just not its own shadow. Yes. What else about the science of the game do you find inaccurate? Um. Go on, Neil deGrasse Tyson, on me. What else? Hard you got? to say. <laughs> Hard to say. Yeah. Um, I mean, it's so... It's, it's just so realistic. Um, If Luigi flew that fast, his skin would tear off his face! <laughs> Is that your Neil deGrasse Tyson? <laughs> yes. Wow. That's, uh, that's creation, just Neil deGrasse Tyson. Oh, okay. he, has a, he has a very <laughs> calm voice. Mario Galaxy 2, they're going to only be 6,000 years old! <laughs> there ain't enough time for all these lava worlds to form in 6,000 years! Excuse me! Pardon me! Pardon. Welcome to the galaxy. Welcome. Why those little helmets? Congratulations. Welcome to- who, who would say welcome to the galaxy? There's nobody there! Sherry would say it. Okay. <laughs> you, I bet you- I just see a shadow. Do you? Yeah. That's a Comet Metal Shadow. Oh, never mind. It was a shadow of something else. It's not altogether obvious that you can even get up here, so the star may elude many people. Platforming. Platforming. <laughs> nice. Badass platforming. <laughs> sure. Remember in the beginning of the LP when I couldn't do that, and now it's like, psh! 
It's like you really for come you. into your own as a gamer. Just because you jump three times does not mean on your third jump you would go significantly higher. <laughs> what is that terrifying noise? <laughs> you should Sorry. do one. Uh, you should do something in the uh, form of a Jeff Fox really joke. <laughs> I mean, you basically are. <laughs> like, I guess so. If you burn your butt in lava three times, you might be bad, Mario Galaxy. <laughs> <laughs> and speaking of that, uh oh, uh -oh. you can uh -oh. vaguely hear, or at least you could. Yeah. I... Now it's ow. But this is a circular place, so that mm, you see it. I hear it. I see it. Maybe I hear it. Oh, now I see it. There it is. Don't die. Good luck. Um, but fortunately, we got a little bit of an insurance policy in the form of yeah. six slices of health pie. Delicious. You can probably get this with one clean jump and not even have to burn your butthole in the lava, but... <laughs> That's not the fun way to do it. <laughs> no. Gotta always be pressing those boundaries. That's right. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. You got a star. You are a star. Yeah, huh? You have and are a star. That is what you are. <laughs> Coming from above, Enough. reaching for the stars. Thank you. <laughs> and that is World One. Uh, good job. Hooray! Any final thoughts? Okay.